Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Hope you're all doing well. So today I have my nighttime routine for you and to be honest this was a very boring night but let's just get started. So I'm getting ready for my shower and well there you go I'm already in the shower. So I start off just by wetting my hair and if you're wondering why I'm like acting all awkward it's because I'm filming while I'm in the shower. <laughs> so I have a new skincare range and I'm using Dermalogica now. And the first thing that I am using today is the Dermalogica Pre-Cleanse. And this is like an oil-based cleanser and it just removes all the, uh, 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 all the oil and all the dirt before you go in with your actual cleanser. And I actually really like this. It makes my skin feel very nice. And then just rinsing all of that off. And because it is an oil-based, I was terrified it wasn't going to come off, but it did really easily. Next I'm going with my Matrix Biolag, Biolage, I don't know how to pronounce it, but this is the shampoo that I use and it is like a mint based shampoo. It's just awesome for super oily hair, which is what I have, so if you guys suffer from oily hair, definitely have a look at this and then I'm just having a bit of dance in the shower, really nothing new here. <laughs> I'm then just going to rinse out all that shampoo and I do this twice just to make sure my hair is extra clean. There I go again. Oh god, and the camera's fogging up. <laughs> Next I'm going with my head and shoulders conditioner. This is the clean and balanced one. This is the only one that I have found that has actually worked for my hair. Like I said before, I suffer from really oily hair so it's hard to find products that work for me. I'm just rinsing all the water out of my hair so the conditioner doesn't slip out straight away. And then I'm rubbing it between my hands and then I just work this through my ends and I keep it away from my roots just so I don't get oily hair. Next I'm going with my Dermalogica special cleansing gel um, and this is actually really awesome I'm already starting to notice a couple of differences in my skin which is great it does smell very medicated um, but I don't really have a problem with that it's very smooth on the skin and I'm really enjoying it so far so I'm just gonna work that into my skin and rinse that off straight away Next, I'm going in with the Yuzu and Kokoa shower gel from Lush. This is a orange chocolate based shower gel. It smells amazing, except it just makes you look like a Simpson. Like, look how yellow I am. <laughs> um, but this is an awesome shower gel. It makes me smell so freaking good. And then I'm going in and I'm shaving my hairy gorilla pits. Yes. I get hair under my arms, but what person doesn't? So thought I would show that. <laughs> and then I'm going to go in. I'm also going to shave my big bush hairy legs. And yeah. <laughs> Once I'm done out of the shower, I'm going in with a gentle cream exfoliator. This is like a mask exfoliating thing. Um, the reason why I have this is because I have a lot of breakouts at the moment and I can't exfoliate over the top of my pimples Otherwise, I'm gonna cause a lot of problems. So I'm applying this with my mask brush thingy I don't know where it's from. I can't remember um, and I'm applying a thin layer and I'm leaving that on for 15 minutes After 15 minutes, I am going to rinse this off and it came off so easily. I usually struggle with a lot of my masks and it takes me forever to get it off, but this came off really quick. And once I'm done rinsing all of that off, I'm just going to pat my face dry. And then I'm going in with the Active Moist Moisturizer from Dermalogica and this is an awesome nighttime moisturizer. I freaking love it so much. Next I'm going in with the ultra smoothing eye cream and I just got a sample of this because my under eyes are extremely sensitive and so far so good. Once I'm done with all my skincare and my shower, 
Tonight was a particularly boring night. I wasn't really doing much, so I just hopped on the computer and I decided to edit a couple of my photos and also watch some YouTube, so really nothing new. Tonight I was watching uh, Shan XO or Shannon Harris, um, her new video, and then I was just switching back and forth between YouTube and editing, YouTube, editing, blah, blah, blah. And then when it's starting to get close to bedtime, I just hop into bed and I turn my fairy lights on just because I like the way they look. And then I'm just on my phone, scrolling through my social media, not really doing too much. And this is the point where I start to get tired and cue the yawning. <laughs> this is pretty much my nighttime routine, guys. Um, I don't really do too much. So I really hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I will see you in my next video. Bye!